Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I just want to be really real with you guys and just sit and chat. And I know I'd probably be doing this on my vlog camera just because it's more like a uh, more intimate, I don't know, intimate is the right word, I don't know. But it would be like more real and raw, but I have my big camera out and like I never film with the big camera. So I just decided to film this video on the big camera and have a little bit better quality. I don't know if you guys can tell, maybe not, I don't know. But I wanted to come on here and share why I don't like make a lot of adoption content. And I know that's probably hurting my channel in the long run, um, not producing like a lot of adoption content because that's kind of where people like my videos to be like, it's kind of like what people like my videos to be themed around. They always perform well and um, I love starting discussions in the comment section and there's a lot of other fellow adoptees But I'm just gonna be real and say like I don't like focusing so much that I'm adopted like I get it Like I'm adopted like that happened what 20 years ago and like I don't really have anything else to say Like I feel like I've done all of my video ideas like I could possibly do and I, the one that I just filmed I feel like I've already like said all of that stuff. I feel like I'm just repeating myself. So it's just like really frustrating and I don't know. I want this channel to be like my life and for you to enjoy it. And I love incorporating my parents, but like, again, it's not their channel. You know what I'm saying? So um, I don't want to come off as like, I'm never going to film another adoption video again, but just like, this is the reason why I don't because I feel like I'm repeating myself. I don't like focusing on the fact that I'm adopted because I'm adopted. Like what else is there more to say? Um, and like, I don't know, like, I don't know. It's just like really frustrating. And I do put a lot of time, energy and effort into my other videos on my channel. And I totally understand like there's videos of people. Well, of course there's videos of people all over this website that you're watching, but there's so many like vlogs that vloggers that I don't watch because I don't really like their vlogs. So it's okay if you don't like my vlogs. Like that's totally fine. You can just stay and watch my main channel videos, style videos like this. That's what I watch for some YouTubers. So some YouTubers, I only watch their vlogs. Some YouTubers, I never watch their vlogs. So um, it's fine if you do that with me, but like try to check out some of my other content, like my reviews or something. I don't know. My reviews actually do really well. Yeah. I just don't always, I don't want this channel and I never intended for that video to like blow up and people to be interested in adoption like that. So I never really saw that coming, but this channel intentionally was set up for me to do whatever I wanted and to not niche down. And I'm really, really trying to stick to my core and like what I set out to do, which I set out to just share my life and to have fun and share my memories and to share how semi-normal my family like my immediate family is um because i do grow up in a more diverse life um uh, i don't know parent child structure than most people so i know that those videos do well with my parents which is great i want them to do well but my adoption content is just like i don't want this channel i guess what i'm getting at i don't want this channel to be like solely adoption and I don't want to turn it into that because that's not what I set out to do and it's a part of me but it's not what I identify with and I don't want people to think that I only identify with that because like I have this great fun life in Orlando Florida that I want to share with you guys so I don't know I just wanted to be real with you and just share why my adoption content has kind of like fallen off the cliff um, for National Adoption Month, I do want to have one of my shaman sisters or like multiple shaman sisters, like the girls I was adopted with come on my channel and do like sort of an interview. Um, so they would like, I would be thinking maybe I would send them a list of questions and they would just film themselves on their iPhone and like send it over. 
maybe like through a Google Drive or something like that. So I do have some video ideas, but like that's the only idea that I have because um, I would want to be creative yet I wouldn't want sorry about the lighting by the way <laughs> but I would want to be creative and you know have them share their stories and everything but again I don't want this channel to be like adoption only if you get what I'm saying like yeah that's why you haven't seen a lot of adoption content on the channel and I hope you guys stick around um, I know this might hurt my channel as in subscriber numbers, um, but a lot of you guys like commentary and everything. So I still want to do sit down videos like this about certain topics, whether it be adoption, whether it be life advice. Um, I'm planning on filming confessions of a dancer. Um, so those types of videos are so fun to film and I hope you guys want to stick around and join me on the ride that I'm on online and everything and follow me on instagram because i'm having you know a crisis with that not knowing like reels or photos because i don't know it's just a little difficult first world problems i know that there's so much like more to <laughs> there's so many more things to be worrying about but i just wanted to come on and share with you guys like what i've been thinking and kind of like say sorry that there hasn't been a lot of adoption content because of the things I just said. So um, again, I hope you guys stick around and I wanna thank you all so much for not only loving my adoption content, not only loving seeing my parents, but also like watching the videos that I do put time and effort into, like my vlogs and stuff, because I'm really trying to make them longer for you and for more conversation. Like I just wanna feel like I am you know, with a friend. You know what I'm saying? Because like when I watch people's vlogs or content, like I legit feel like they're my friend and I'm just like listening to them talk like this. So yeah, I don't know. I hope that something, some of that made sense to you guys. I know it was kind of like weird, but anyway, um, that is going to be it for this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, ideas, leave them in the comment section down below because I would love to know. Um, I've planned out some videos and I plan on vlogging more obviously. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.